I guess, not, in terms yeah, of entrance and stuff. And uh, it's going to be exciting to see what the new venue and like these new events are going to bring to the Odyssey. It'll be, it'll be like, but while we're on that, um, we are now switching over, heading right into the game between Dang Falcon and Spiral, the Ninja vs. Corrin on yeah. Battlefield. Spiral's actually been putting in some work lately. Oh, he's gotten a lot better for sure. Like, mm -hmm. he's definitely one of the he's definitely one of the rising stars of Ottawa at the moment. Uh, Dang Falcon hasn't been playing as much as Weeklies. At Weeklies, rather, yeah. early this season he was pretty much non-existent, but recently he's been making a little bit of a comeback. Been playing a little bit more. So yeah, I'm pretty sure he said uh, the only times he really practices is at the Monday tournaments. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is a. Uh, Spiral definitely practices a little bit more than yeah. that. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I believe he's in a Discord where he gets coached. Um, Dang, nice. Yeah, he, uh, he definitely, he's uh, one of the harder working uh, players in the team for sure. Oh, oh good up B, wow. Mm -hmm. Catching Spiral by surprise. And right now, Team Fa <laughs> Dang Falcon with his uh, minimal uh, practice has the edge. <laughs> oh, oh, that my F goodness. smash, no fear at all. He just did not care about Spiral's entire existence. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I mean, not much of a risk to throw it out at that distance. <laughs> oh no, and absolutely. It hit me, so. Yeah, it worked out. Yeah. And right now, just it's Dang Falcon just needs to play a little safe, just needs to, you know. Yeah, no really reason to approach right now. Exactly. Let's <laughs> grab, let's see if we get something started. I mean, yeah, it's definitely not gonna work. It's really hard to stay by that uh, ledge with the on B, because it can, it's kind of like Marts in a way where you can uh, flip people underneath the Exactly, so you don't have to like shield it or something or maybe jump over it, but uh, yeah, right there, Spiral, not really getting much off of his, uh, he's not really converting anything at the moment. Is that Dark Falcon? He keeps winning neutral, but unless he converts into some big damage, he's not going to gain any ground. I just can't see. <laughs> I got, I'm I got laughing sorry in the background, for that, Sorry for that distraction. <laughs> okay, gets the up throw. What? Yeah, like you said, like Spiral just seems like he's struggling to get in right now. Like he, you know, he'll, get, he'll win the neutral, but he will just get no conversions right yeah, now. Every yeah. time he wins, he's got like six, nine percent tops. And uh, he's got to start catching on Dang Falcon's habits in the disadvantage state. Oh my goodness, that counter! Jeez. Not gonna do it though. That was like max range counter. Yeah. yeah. It's a side B. And Spiral is struggling so hard oh, yeah. to clean up this sock. That's not gonna do it, but he is in a really bad spot. Oh, that was dangerous. Okay. Okay. Not quite again. Dang Falcon is playing focused, playing safe. And he's he's out for blood right now. He's looking for that kill and blow. Okay, I thought he was gonna intercept his recovery with the there. Yeah, didn't work out though. Oh, okay, he gets away with the yeah. <laughs> right now, okay. We're both trying to get the grab. Yeah, that's gonna take it. Mm -hmm. Two Dang. stocks. That was a pretty clean game by Dang, too. Yeah. He's doing a great job of minimizing damage, not being obvious in the disadvantage state. You know, like, he just. I was impressed there. Yeah. He it wasn't, like, really uh, over committing to anything. He was like, I'm up, so I'm just gonna play it safe. Exactly. If there's one thing Dang's been working on in the few times he does play, it's definitely. Playing safer. For sure. Exactly. Yeah, but I feel like everyone struggles with that like early game kind of thing. It's like, oh, I want to get these cool combos, and then you're like, wait, camping shield is a good option. Yeah. And then, <laughs> and it's like, welcome to Smash Four, yeah. ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right, and we are going to be seeing Smashville now. Spiral going to have to find it in himself. Going to have to dig deep, you know. All right. Falcon starting off much the same way, just walking up to gain stage control, playing the safe, not throwing out any options yet. Okay, spy with the up air. Yeah, I think they're just. I don't know, I feel like Spyro's just trying to plan a way to find an opening, I'm guessing. Yeah, well, I, like, the thing is, at the beginning of the last game, Dang Falcon got that really explosive start right off the bat. Yeah. And he converted one combo into literally a kill, yeah. all, like, at like 30. So that gave him such like a like an edge in terms of just okay I can just you know yeah. I'm, I'm like I'm down to play this game where we just chip at each other and I'm just gonna get the grab at the end of, you know but right now he's on the losing end of that battle yeah. so we'll see how that changes the outcome of this match. Okay. 
Spiral's actually been doing a really good job with those uh, shurikens. Mm -hmm. Keeping dank out. Yeah. But one thing he did struggle with last game was getting you know that big conversion. Okay, yeah. right here he's getting something started. He's gonna have to start reading Dank Falcon's options in the disadvantage state because honestly, a lot of what we're seeing right now is Spiral will go for that like that safe confirm, and then he won't actually go. He'll go like he doesn't commit. You know yeah. what I mean? Like. I'm, I'm not gonna say he doesn't overcommit because like he's just he, he should be committing a little bit more, you know what yeah. I mean? You had a couple games now to you know really catch on to what your opponent's doing and uh, we'll see if Spiral does catch on to him. Okay. Yeah, nice. search for habits and just like, especially as Greninja, right? Like yeah. it's like kill setups very few, especially at like later percents, like it's real tough. We'll see right now when he gets the fair. Okay, good fair there too. He's definitely walled him out. Not getting Ooh. any stage control, and there we go. Right. That's the confirm he was looking for. Spiral is the one with the big lead this game. Let's see what Dang Falcon can do to make this back. And we're gonna see if uh, Dang's gonna opt to go more aggressive now that he's behind, or is he gonna keep his full head like he's been doing the whole set? Now, honestly, we'll see, because he was, he was losing, he was getting outplayed pretty much the entire yeah. neutral of that stock, so. Gonna have to change something up, that's for sure. And he gets the pin Jeez. right there. Oh, like, that was horrid, DI. Yeah. Spiral. <laughs> I was like, wait, yeah. wait a second. He wasn't at 100. <laughs> yeah, Spiral was leaning back a little bit, and he realized, he was like, oh my god, that might actually kill me. Oh my oh, goodness, wow. that was so dangerous by Spiral. Right now, just yeah. trying to find that killing blow. And Spiral doing his best to just continue chipping away at him. Yeah, for sure. Any percent is good percent on mm -hmm. your second stop, so. Exactly. As as the fake out with the balloon, let's go. <laughs> oh, he oh, had oh, awful core and grab, yeah. Good in there to bear. Mm -hmm. Let's just go. And right now, Smile's got complete control of this game. Just waiting out the last <laughs> The, the yeah. patience, let's go. <laughs> Both players oh, just. Oh, oh wow, no. good call out for that roll. That should be free right, grab. Like okay. Spiral's doing a really good job at maintaining this mm -hmm. Both players showing uh, great strength in that area, to be honest. Like, both of them did a great job of maintaining it. We will see if Kyle can find that blow, though. It's not over yet. Spiral has not actually closed out the game. But as I say that... Oh, okay, oh, wow. he just escaped yeah. him. I forgot about that, honestly. That's dangerous. Okay, he just jumps away this time. Oh, oh great him! Yep. Mixing up... Oh, man, I was actually really nice by that. Yeah. You can't edge guard. Yeah. yeah. Get him out of here. A lot of players will be really scared in that situation and just air dodge right there, dang exactly, and just yeah. like, you know, honestly, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get you right out of my face. Especially when uh, you got a lead, you tend to play with a little bit more confidence. Exactly. Not be too scared off stage. So he was like, you know what? I'm gonna go for this. Take his <laughs> Okay, that's not okay. He does get out of it. Oh my god, he's in danger of getting pinned. Honestly, Dang Falcon is right in this. He just needs a couple more reads, and all of a sudden, you know, he can kill you with the Tipper Hot 60. <laughs> I wonder uh, if this does go to a game 3 situation, if uh, Dang Falcon will adapt to that jab with the mm -hmm. Shadow Sneak and just opt it for going to the gentleman. Yeah, I definitely feel that. Greninja jumps so high, my goodness. Mm -hmm. This is this is an uphill battle for Dank right now. Yeah, the talk is definitely playing a factor in this right now. We'll see. Oh yeah, I didn't even notice. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, that's getting already, real like... low. Okay, but right now, Dank getting a little Time something started. Has the stage control to do something. Okay. Oh no, he gives it up there. Sacrifices a little for free too. Great DI. Honestly, like we're completely underrating Dank's DI on yeah. pretty much every throw, even on the combo throws for those like down throw fairs, on the up throws there at kill percent. Dank Falcon wow. is. I'm surprised he didn't go to the shadow. Maybe it doesn't work at this percent. I'm not sure. Very impressed with the way Dank is playing this from behind right now, but the clock is ticking. He's gonna have to find that killing blow real soon. Oh, he and he, the oh, right there, finally, yeah. Spiral converting off of the fourth or something down. Especially, so. especially when the clock's ticking down like that, you're just like, I gotta do something, man. Like, yeah. That's he's definitely up. probably why he went for the, uh, the counter. Honestly, he still had 40 seconds if he continued playing the way he was playing, though. Like, yeah. that was some really, that was a really good comeback time. Yeah. Pin definitely would kill that, like, what, 100? Mm -hmm. Especially on Smash. Oh, 100? If he gets a tipper, he's dead at Oh, 70. well, yeah, the yeah. tipper. I mean, like, uh, if you pin him into the ground. Mm -hmm. So uh, he definitely had a bit of time there, but we'll see what he does this game on another tri-platform stage, which is, you know, what Dan Falcon really likes, so. 
Cord really likes for that matter. Yeah. It's a lot harder for uh for uh Greninja to trap landings on platform stages because that's really where he sells. Yeah. Okay, that's a floor throw. Right now it is a pretty slow beginning. Both yeah. players once again playing extremely safe. Just taking their time on their approaches, not going for any overcommitments. And we're, uh, last game we saw Spiral taking that early lead in this game. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dank taking that early lead. It's like, you know what, this is a tri-platform. Never mind him. Yeah. A certain is dominant. <laughs> and we'll see, and like, what we're seeing a lot of right now is, like, every time Spiral gets something on Dank, like, that's a hit, they'll just retreat to the platform. Yeah. And Spiral is not... I mean, I'm not sure what Greninja does to follow on the platform, but Spiral's not doing a great job of following that. And right now, they're playing a really <laughs> awkward game of uh, shoot my uh, whatever water projectile I have at you. So. That was a quality game, <laughs> Pablo. <laughs> All right, and right now, Spiral slowly regaining his lead by just camping the yeah. ledge, really, and throwing shurikens. <laughs> Surprise, it's working, but it is. It's a good move. Yeah, it's a pretty, pretty good projectile. I mean, honestly, 60 of those percent. I mean, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, most of them were sure. Oh, yeah. boy. Oh, right, okay. Great mix of on two, but he gets absolutely nothing after the pin, unfortunately. <laughs> Spiral's like, you know, last time we did this, it paid off for me. I'm going to keep doing it. I'm serious. <laughs> I think he was looking for the down. Oh, that cross up again. That makes him working really well for Dank. Oh, great. Oh, again. Dank is just crossing him the heck up right now. And with the Corrin, is slow, with the character slow as Corrin, sorry. You know, you don't normally see him yeah. going for that many cross ups, but he's working so well against Spiral, who's kind of playing a little stiff, a little rigid. He definitely needs to play a little more mobile, so that's where he excels in the matchup. Yeah, and honestly, the way these guys are playing right now, I think we actually might see a. Uh, Situation. Yeah, this is game. last game got really close yeah. to it. The clock has definitely been a huge factor in this set. <laughs> oh, that was a, oh, wow. that was very Kinda optimistic. Lovely. This is such an amazing oh, opportunity, but he doesn't quite get it. Jeez, that Pop, sucks. Mm -hmm, popped right out. Okay. Oh my goodness, both characters looking for that up though, and that is not going to do it. Yeah. Is that one or stronger? Two, I, uh, I think they're the same, it depends. Oh, it's a DI mix up. Oh, okay, there okay. we go. That is it. Right now, Corrin with the lead. This is going to be really difficult for Spiral to come back if the past two games were any indication in that both players are doing really well oh at maintaining their lead. But yeah, this is, as I say wow. that, he just edge guards the Good living stuff. heck, just nodding his head slowly. You know, he's, I got that, I got that edge guard, you know. Oh, that was a shield of uh, shield grab opportunity for four in there. Oh no! Didn't realize that it ate his jump. Very oh, unfortunate for Dennis. He's not happy about that, and I don't blame him. That's just you never want to see a set end like that. They're both playing so well. That's it. <laughs> you know what? At the end of the day, you gotta shake that stuff off, though. Can't have that. Uh, can't let that tear through you. Smash 4, ladies and gentlemen. It happens, that's, man. That's the happens. game. That's the game. Oh, man,